Yo guys, what is going on? Welcome back to another video on the channel. We haven't had a review in a couple days. Um, apologies on that. We do have a little bit of a unique review today. This is probably one of the only other players that I want to try out from the Libra to Doris promo. Um, this is going to be Carlos Tevez, guys. Um, and he's quite expensive. He's not cheap. Um, he's, a, he's a player that is very, very expensive. But I think he's a guy that all of us at some point have seen play in real life. And uh, finally, he has a really nice card. He, had a, he actually had, a, I think, a flashback last year, but a very, very solid looking card. He's 940k on the market right now. Um, so yeah, that's where his price currently is. He's also very rare, man. It's kind of crazy to see that it's just his supply is so low. If you guys enjoy the video today, a thumbs up is super appreciated. Um, so we've got here high low work rates on Carlos Tevez. Comes with four star, four star as well. Five foot seven. 90 pace, 90 shooting, 84 passing, 92 dribbling, and 94 physical. So some pretty uh, pretty solid looking stats, you know, before anything else. Um, and then as we look a little bit more into the card, um, obviously, Tevez has some more stuff to go with him. He does have the team player trait, the outside foot shot trait, and as you guys know, the lovely finesse shot trait that I am genuinely in love with, right? High-low is great um, for a striker. He's four-star, four-star again. Um, what I like about this card is that He's very usable at cam or at striker. Um, he's got 93 acceleration with 87 sprint speed, 91 attack positioning, 91 finishing, 95 shot power, which is all very good. Long shots over 80 is important. Volleys are good. So we're passing at 89 is very good. Long passing might need some work. Vision is okay. Agility balance are very good, 89 and 93. Uh, respectively, he's got 87 reactions, uh, 92 ball control, 92 dribbling, and 97 composure. 97 composure is such an impressive stat. I think also what I really like with this guy is that he's got 99 strength and 99 aggression. I mean, that should just make him a beast. And that's also why, in a way, I don't necessarily... I, I kind of want to even play him at striker. I know he comes as a cam, but for me, if we slapped an you know either an engine or a hunter on this guy, or even maybe a hawk... No, a hawk doesn't make sense because of the strength, but this guy looks really like really strong, so I almost want to play him in that striker role. Because he's 4-star, four 4-star, four because he's high-low... He looks like a guy that would just be fit the striker role real, really well. He has very good stats in the important ones in terms of almost 90 agility, 99 strength, 97 composure, and then amazing finishing uh, and attack positioning. So really good to see that this card looks very very usable, um, and he looks like he he looks like he he looks like he is somewhat warranted of the prices is, is kind of the way that I I would put it. He looks like that I could understand you wanting to spend uh, x amount of coins uh, to go ahead and obtain this card because. You know he he he's got he's got uh, he's got all all you would like to, you know to fulfill those roles. So I think we have an Argentinian team. We could double check though. I, we did have an Argentinian team. We got to see if we can slot in uh, a center back from Argentina. We've kind of been going into division rivals with like theme teams um, that so we can get full chemistry for the team. So we do have an Argentinian team. Uh, I think I'm gonna take out Paredes and put in uh, put in uh, Tevez. So we're going to put in Tevez right now. I did not spell that correctly. Tevez. All right. So Carlos Tevez, he's going into the team. And then obviously, I think he's as a cam. So we make him a center mid. Should be on full chemistry. I think, I think I'm going to give him the hunter, guys. I think I'm going to give him the hunter chemistry style. Now, we may have to go buy a hunter. We do have a hunter in the club. Now, with the 10 chemistry and with the hunter boost, guys, you're going to see Tevez go up to 99 acceleration, 97 sprint speed, 96 attack positioning, and 96 finishing. So those look very good with good volleys and good penalties as well. So all that looks pretty good. Uh, the way we'll line up this team today, guys, we'll try out a couple different formations. Uh, I think to start with, just because I have been enjoying this formation uh, quite a fair bit on FIFA, I can't even lie. 4-4-2. Uh, I want to try this formation out. I've been trying this on the review account. And so the way we'll line up, guys, we'll go with Messi uh, and Tevez up top is kind of how we'll do it. We're going to play Aguero as a wide cam because that's really all I can do. Uh, we could play Messi out wide, but for me, that wastes, that does waste Messi, Messi uh, quite a fair bit. So, obviously, I don't want to end up doing that. If EA could let me select the Paul, that would be awesome. Uh, it's not. Okay, there we go. We had him. There we go. So, we're going to end up doing it like that. And then we will play. Um, Messi is obviously going to play the false nine. Then we'll have Tevez just get in behind. That's kind of how we'll do it. So, yeah, we're going to search for a Division Rivals game today. I don't know how long it's going to take because, um, obviously, the skill rating on this account is decent it's not amazing it's decent it's like i think it's almost at 1800 1700 and uh obviously guys you know if we're playing somebody's doing objectives we will give them the win i always have no problem doing that um we're just really here today to test out how this player is tevis man let's see what he's all about i'm very curious man i you know i haven't used tevis I, I don't even think i tried his flashback card last year so 
Today should be a, a, an interesting evaluation in terms of how good this card is. Let's see who our first opponent is. All right, so first opponent, Tiki Taka. Uh, he does have a red sun, although I bet he got that from last week in league. I bet he got it from last week in league. Messi. That strength is insane, man. His turning strength there was nuts. Messi. Let's test that pace out, Tevez. Tevez, oh, the post! Messi, Tevez. The strength is obviously shown there, man. The way he can turn and stuff um, because of his high strength is, is very impressive. Don't know why he didn't lock on there. That's just more of a FIFA mechanic thing. Nice pass. Tevez, the post! And I think I just green timed a rebound. I have no idea what I've just done. We get the first goal with Tevez. Quite an interesting one. Um, but Nice pass. Love the dribbling. Nice play. Has to be a finish, man. Has to be a finish. Probably should have chipped it, but still. Like my chances at the finesse near post angle there. Kevin De Bruyne with the corner. Salah. Damn, nice finish from Salah off the corner, and he levels it. Well, we often criticize the officials, but he got that spot on. Carlos Tevez. What a ball. Messi! Messi! All right, guys, first game is a draw. Honestly, not too impressed with him. Um, We have him as 99 pace with a chemistry style, and he just doesn't feel like he has it. I do notice the strength big time, but definitely this guy does not feel like he has 99 pace, and I don't know why. Very weird. So we'll try, we'll try another game. We'll see how he goes. Um, finishing has been a little eh. We got a couple good angles with him. I would like to get a couple more angles to really give you guys the full insight to it. Um, so we're going to go ahead. We're going to search for another game, and uh, we will see who we get. So game number two of the video. We've got a Red Ramos, a flashback David. No, a uh, Shapeshifters David Luis. Firmino Rashford Salah. Let's try to pick up a win on the video, guys. Let's try to make sure that we are victorious uh, in this game. Decent position from the goalkeeper. Poor shot, to be honest with you. What a ball, Tevez, let's go. Oh, let's go, what a run. Amazing, amazing playing behind. That's 99 pace. That's what I've been looking for. All last game that I didn't see, we used the chip uh, lob through ball to get that through. He's got the defense, boys. That's what comes when you got good physicals. You got, you got the defensive statistics, man. Unlucky, man. Nice little link of play with Aguero, though. Let's go. Let's go. It's a kickoff, but we go up to one. Very nice from Acuna on the wing into Messi, our main man, um, for the 2-1 advantage. Tevez! In the right place at the right time. 3-1. Unbelievable strength there. I wasn't able to turn, but that that's his strength. Wonderfully weighted pass. And he might be in here. It has to be, surely. Gotta be a foul somewhere, no? How did I miss that? After all that, boys, we don't get a goal out of that. I don't know how I missed that. Go on, Tevez. Show me that pace. There's that strength that we're paying for, and we miss it. We miss the chance right there. We miss the chance. Not a good sign. Find him. Let's go, Tevez. Oh, the strength. Oh, the strength on Ramos. The strength is what's going to make this card, man. It really is, because as he's turning and, and you have sequences and times of balance, man, woo, it's going to be nice. And that's an important intervention. A real struggle to contain him. Tevez, oh, the post! The post, man, from Tevez, the post. He's given it straight to the opposition. Wonderfully weighted pass, and he could cash in. 
It's a pin! It's a pin, ref! All right, boys. Tevez is going top corner, man. Ready? That was not top corner, but it was a penalty goal. So that's all that matters. A penalty goal. We got it to go. All right, boys. So that is going to be the review for Tevez today. You know, I, I started off game one, and I thought he was kind of an average striker. I didn't really notice him to be that different. Could be connection. Could be things. You guys know how FIFA goes. Uh, strengths with this card. Explosive. Very strong. Um, that's what I like about him. I would recommend you use him 100% in the camera striker role. Um, and, you know, he can play a 4 2 3 one, one striker. He's 100% strong enough to do that. The downside is you're going to get no jumping or heading accuracy with him. But heading in this game is quite dead. We all know that. Uh, great finisher of the ball. I recommend doing the finesse shots with him. Every finesse shot that I took with him was very much in. Um, I think we only took one or two, but they were in. They were money. That's the finesse shot trait. So use the traits that he has that are good to his advantage. Um, I, You know, it didn't feel like 99 pace, but then we had that one sequence on the breakaway that did very much look nice with him. You know, I think it's a great card, man. I think he's good. I don't think he has too many flaws. What I would recommend to you guys as well is that when you are, you know, doing the getting behind passes and things like that, shot fake boost with this card. Use the shot fake boost to your advantage against defenders um, cutting inside because of his high strength. He hardly gets taken off the ball. So that's going to be the video today, guys. Tevez was very, very good, man. So impressed to see that he's good. I always like to, to kind of test out these cards because sometimes the crazy boost doesn't always live up to the stats. This guy is definitely pretty solid. Thank you guys for watching. See you guys soon. Bye-bye.